I was born in the Philippines and I moved here when I was nine years old. I am a Pacific Islander, born and raised on the beautiful island of Guam. I am a Filipino American. I am Filipino. Filipina American. I am second generation Filipina American. I am a small business owner. I'm a content creator. I am a DJ. I used to DJ for nine years before I stopped. The pandemic got me back into DJing again. I am an organizer for Girls Rock New Orleans, a summer music camp for girls, trans, and gender non-conforming youth. I personally love it because we teach the youth to harness their own power. I don't know how to play a musical instrument, but I'm in events, I know operations, and um, that skill was useful. I'm a passionate planner. I love to plan parties, vacations, events, galas, you name it. My favorite family tradition are the birthday parties. We would party for about 12 hours and we'd eat good food the whole time. Food is like the center of like everything, right? And there's always more food than there is people. So there's always food to bring home, but I think it's like the comfort and it's like bringing the family together. My heritage is important to me because it's something my mom gave to me and it's a really good way to honor her whenever I wear my heritage proudly and I carry on the traditions that she's taught me. The Philippines has been known to have some of the most welcoming and happiest people. So growing up, I always believed that everyone is created equal. And with recent events, it's just been really hard to feel that way. So I think it's important for everyone to show kindness to one another, to stand up for one another, and to feel like you belong. I'm a product manager for Cloud Infrastructure Services. I am an administrative assistant. I'm an event content manager for the Global Events Marketing Team. I am a million data points. I am a million data points. I am a million data points. <laughs>